today's referee is Jeremy Shear and will get us going here momentarily. Colorado Springs and manager Brendan Burke taking on Louisville City and manager Denny Cruz. We are underway. We'll be lofting into the penalty area. It's dangerous here. It lands at the feet of Ombi. Thought he might have trapped it with his arm, but it's well saved there as Masoso's follow-up effort is dragged wide. But Ombi was unmarked right in the heart of the penalty area. I think he'd made up his mind to hit it. Have a look here. He's trying to, he's trying to hit a ball. I think he might. Colorado Springs insist on playing. And Barry oh. demonstrating the full breadth of his skill set there. Hitting a lovely switch to Galena. Galena now running into the penalty area at Gomez. Galena on his left. And he's hit the outside of the post with a good effort there. The best moment of the match for Colorado Springs. He's got this pace, Galena. Does a little bit of a body swerve, just gets it in. A now again, Sharpie to send the cross in, nodded across. In there was McMahon, and it's gone flashing across the face of goal there, and Rodriguez marshalling it out of play. Post, have a look here. The marking at the back by the switchbacks is a little bit poor. Just too easy for that ball to get knocked straight back in. And McMahon. Now the cross swung in. McCabe was there, but. Out popped Mahoney to deal with it. Nice touches there from Gomez. Away from pressure into Gonzalez. It's a lovely one too. Gomez now squares it and it's turned in. Lovely work there. It's the one-two that sets up the chance for Antoine Opino, who gets his first goal in 2021. And it's Louisville who find the breakthrough on 73 minutes. Good turn here from Gomez. Plays the one-two, gets it back has the pace to get ahead of his defender, puts in the ideal ball there for Hopeno, who's got to tap it in the back of the net. Credit also to Jorge Gonzalez for making the one-two there. Matthew Mahoney. Nice touch there into space there from Galena. In a cut inside. Misha Galena's left-footed effort is squeezed in beyond Hubbard. The first major save he had to make, and he spilled it. Allowing Mishi Galina to flip his way into an equalizing goal. Cuts inside, he keeps on going. As a dip, goalkeeper goes on. It's a standard save for Hubbard, and he knows that he drops his head to the ground straight away, but it wouldn't have happened if. Switchbacks may be a tad lucky that the Hubbard error got them back in the match, but I think it's been a, a wonderful night's entertainment from both sides. And there is the full time whistle. Colorado Springs and Louisville City sharing the point on this night.